Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Mad Scoops Custom Ice Cream. Uh, this is the vanilla, the chocolate. Cookies and cream and cookie monster. These were bought at, believe it or not, a pizza joint. It's called Big City, uh, The Big City Pizza Company. And Kevin actually did a lunchtime review there. Their pizza was awesome. I got to try it too. And um, when we went in to pick up these ice creams, it's like, oh my gosh, it smells so good. And they have sandwiches, they have all kinds of stuff. But anyway, when Kevin way, way back, he did a lunchtime review there, he said, they sell this ice cream in there I've never seen before, so. And we couldn't get it at that time because we were running around doing right. things. But I, I bought dry ice, and so we were able to get these. They were not cheap. They were $7.99 a piece. Um, and then Kevin looked it up online. It looks like if you go to one of their shops, you can get them for $6.99 a piece. So we paid $7.99 a piece at the pizza The convenience place. for not driving to Richmond. Exactly. <laughs> These are made in Richmond, Kentucky. So this is a local company. So for that reason, these are not sealed. Anytime we're able to buy them from an actual business, um, we don't mind if it's not sealed. So if it comes directly from Baskin Robbins, we don't mind. Um, if it comes, we have bought uh, ice creams directly from uh, Cold Stone Creamery. Those were not sealed either. It's okay, we don't mind. So this place, they went directly from Mad Scoops to the pizza company, it's okay. So that's why we're trying it. These are- Was it for the public to lick on? No, exactly. So uh, this is a 16 ounce container and this is just vanilla. And they don't really say much on them except the ingredients. Um, th no, there's no calories. Um, so that might be a good or ba bad thing. Just depending on how you look at it. There's really nothing, nothing to see. Nothing to show there. <laughs> just nothing to see after. here, just vanilla. I've had these laying out for, uh, what, 10 minutes yeah, or so? Probably, yeah. And I love a good vanilla. It's good. It almost has a soft serve kind of, almost homemade kind of vanilla flavor. I can see what Kevin's saying about it almost being homemade, mm -hmm. but our homemade is sweeter than that. Mm -hmm. I prefer, it does remind me of a homemade ice cream. I prefer ours over that. Uh, yeah, be, but just if you were buying, Because it's sweeter. I like, I'll, I want something sweeter. I think it's a good vanilla ice cream. It's, it's very basic vanilla, you know, so it's nothing fancy, but it, it's a good, it's good vanilla. Kevin is, um, Kevin loves vanilla. I love vanilla ice cream. So if Kevin's telling you he likes it, that's, that's great. It um, has a, even has a little bit of a crystal -y, ice crystal kind of texture. It does. I and, just. And somebody, some people say that's a bad thing. They don't like that. But a homemade ice cream always has that. Homemade ice has cream, that icy texture. Yeah. And that's how you can identify homemade ice cream really is. And I like that personally. I just wish it was sweeter. It, it's it could good. be sweeter. I just wish it was I sweeter. Agree. It could be okay. Sweeter. So this is the chocolate. And once again, there's not going to be. Much look at. Uh, yeah, it's brown. <laughs> Textures are good. That is very different from chocolate that you get at the store. Mm -hmm. the it's good though. It mm -hmm. almost has a, a frosty, almost malty flavor. I agree. Yeah, and that is more between chocolate ice cream and a frosty that you would get at um, Wendy's. Wendy's. I would say, yeah, it's in the middle. Kind of in the middle. Kind, yeah. of, kind of has just a touch of a kind of a frosty kind of flavor. Mm -hmm. It's good though. I, I, like like the, the, I like the chocolate more than the vanilla because it comes across as sweeter to It's me. still not as sweet though. Not as sweet as you would get at the store. Right. Okay, now we're going on to cookies and cream and no description on here, but, but um, that looks like cookies and cream. It looks like it has a little Oreo cookie piece. In it. Yeah. I'm assuming they used Oreo, but they might not have one. Wow. <laughs> Okay, there's more to see here. Yeah, it's got some pretty yeah. good sized hunks of big hunks of cookies. Oreo in there. 
I mean, like I said, I don't know if they used Oreo. They might have used Hydrox or something. You hope not. Okay. That's I know, awesome. I know exactly what that tastes like. That is absolutely wonderful. Okay, go ahead. Ice cream sandwich. Yeah, that's what it is. Yes. Mm -hmm. If you ever had the ice cream sandwiches, chocolate ice cream with, I mean, chocolate sandwiches mm -hmm. with the vanilla ice cream in the middle, this is a really good version of mm -hmm. those ice cream sandwiches. Because the, ice, the, the cookies have that kind of flavor of that, of that yes. stick to your finger cookie. That chocolate cookie. Yeah. It's uh, very good. That is absolutely. So compared to the chocolate vanilla, that's like, what company are we looking at again? <laughs> <laughs> it's that different. Mm -hmm. It's like night and day difference between and the first two and this one mm -hmm. and that is they should have called that instead of calling it cookies and cream they should have called it ice cream ice sandwich because yeah. that i could eat that whole pint right now it's very good that's how good it is like that's five out of five mm -hmm. okay. but i also get the little um i think i just got a texture of like a cream from like the inside of an oreo and it probably like that is dense cream mm -hmm. The sugary cream. Right. It's very, very sweet too. It's, it's very good. Now this one is called Cookie Monster and Kevin found a description. It's the only one pretty much that has a description. Yeah, we liked, oh my god. Yeah. It says it's Oreos, graham crackers, and cookie dough pieces blended together in a blue cookie dough flavored ice cream. It's blue. And then it says it's a Richmond favorite. Oh, this one is? Yeah. That surprises me because you would think, uh, like University of Kentucky, uh, this. Where are you getting little pieces? Because I'm. It was all. Uh, oh. I didn't I'm just want it to. Why you were doing that? No, I didn't want it to run off the edge. Because yeah, I'm, you would think like UK. Or... I would think UK blue and Richmond has their own school. It's called Eastern Kentucky University, and their color, their main color is maroon. Okay, so you said it had cookie dough pieces mm -hmm. and Oreos. And Oreo. And graham cracker. And the bait, the, the ice cream itself is just vanilla. Hmm. I like the cookie dough pieces. Mm -hmm. They're like literally Nestle cookie dough pieces that they bought at the store. <laughs> they, they have a grit to them. They're uh -huh. gritty, which is a good thing. They're really nice to eat. Yeah, we already know we like their cookies and cream. Yes. So that's just adding more to mm -hmm. it. I don't really get graham cracker. I mean, I may have gotten a few bites of it. I just didn't know it. But um, I didn't get graham cracker either. But my, this this tastes a lot like their cookies and cream. They just yes. added cookie dough pieces to it. I agree. Which is good. I, I like the addition to it. I like the number of cookies in just the cookies and cream. My complaint about this one is in all that that I got... I got one piece of cookie dough. Mm. So see, I was able to pick and choose. <laughs> yeah, Kevin had the yeah. I I and and to look at it right now, he literally took all the cookie dough off the top. Um, I I would want more cookie dough. That's what the only thing I would ask because I I love this. I I think the color is cool. I love the flavor, but I did not get enough cookie dough to. I want more. Mm -hmm. So, out of these four, I love this, but it's going to be my number two. It'd be my number two. Yeah. The first one is that cookies and cream. Yeah, cookies and cream, 100%. And you said you saw other flavors on the website. What else did oh, you Oh, they've say? got all kinds of, they've got Superman. You said something <laughs> about cotton candy? They have cotton candy. Um, now, I'm digging, and I'm not seeing. Now, I'm looking at the company itself. Does I want not, more cookie dough. The company itself really doesn't have a very good website. I'm gonna scoop out a bunch in that ball. I'm telling you, I'm I'm just oh, is no, I'm just not seeing a lot of cookie dough in here. Um, they their web they don't have a website to go to to look. So I'm going on one of those sites that's called All Menus. They kind of have a bunch of companies menus. Um, but they they list Bananas Foster, which I've seen in a couple of them. Right. Uh, butter pecan, um, chocolate chip, that. Uh, cotton candy, salted caramel, and fudge. That'd be good. Um, it does say Oreo cookies and cream on here. Oh, it does. So those must be Oreos. Uh, peach, peanut butter cup, raspberry chocolate, Superman, uh, strawberry. Yeah. 
and all kinds of different ones. Chocolate covered strawberry. They have one called Hurricane, but didn't have a description. So Ooh. they got all kinds of different stuff. Once again, not near enough. I did find a little pocket of graham cracker, but you really you can't taste it. It's, it doesn't have a strong flavor to yeah, it. I couldn't um, imagine graham cracker adding much to that. No, but I do like it. There truly just needs to be more than the cookie dough because the cookie dough is delicious mm, and it really adds a difference in texture. And just need to have more of it. Mm -hmm. So now I have a, no idea if they ship these. Like, what is that company that ships all that stuff? And it's really I can't think expensive. Of it. it's really expensive, though. Really, really expensive. Um, they might ship. Well, like I said, they really don't have a website. So really, the only thing they have is a Facebook page. Right. So I have a, no idea if they if they will ship this to you or not. Um, but if you can only afford to buy one, if you're going through Richmond or you're in that area or you're having pizza at Big City Pizza, I would totally get that cookies and cream because mm, it is awesome. Good. Terrific. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.